nothing I can do for him now. All units just got word. Constantine is on his way down from the prison. First day in Siberia, and it happens. Two years in Afghanistan and another in Indonesia, nothing. But one day out here on the ice, and pop, I get a kill. I watch the man's eyes go glassy as he begged me for something. I'm not Russian, I'm no clue. I waited with him and watched. One minute he was there, and next, nothing. Just meat. I got sick on the snow, all mixed in with the kid's blood, but he's just meat now, and I'm alive. Constantine keeps telling us we're out here for a special reason, tells us. We need to get this mess in order before he arrives. Hey, can anyone hear me? God damn it, we gotta get comms back up. Never seen anything like that. Crazy son of a bitch. Rushing three armed men with an axe? I don't know how they managed to take one of them alive. Who the hell are these people? Initial recon said there was an old village up in these mountains. But they expected farmers. Thought they'd surrender without firing a shot. Farmers? Shit. These are trained guerrilla fighters. It looks like they drove the Soviets out of here. Might be a good sign. If they're protecting something hidden in the mountain, then we're in the right place. So, do you know what it is we're after? No. Over there! Stop! There's more of them arriving. Until we get someone out here to shut that pump off, I want those crates as far away from the fire as possible. Double time! There's ammo in there, and we can't afford to lose it. Secure. I haven't heard any shots for a few minutes now. I think we're in the clear. Don't count on it. Stay alert until we get the comms re-established with the prison. We're on our own down here. That was Constantine's chopper. What the hell is he doing down here? Not for me to say. They took one of the natives alive in question, but it cost us three men. I'm guessing the man wants to know what they find out. Constantine expects more from us. There was someone to make for that mistake. Prioritize the live rounds. Keep them separate from the rations. Got a feeling we'll want those in easy reach. Yes, sir. Most of these rations were burned in the blast. <laughs> I like this one's a loss. We should set traps around the perimeter. I can rig up a few surprises with this stuff. <laughs>
Nine millimeter rounds, flares. I know I've taken some jobs of questionable legality, and I know you're not happy about it. But I couldn't pass up this contract. Been trying to get work with Trinity for years. They're discreet, the pay is obscene, and they always have opportunities. Now here I am, and I already want out. We're at an abandoned Soviet installation in the middle of nowhere. No one's telling us low-level contractors what's going on, but... I think I might be helping some seriously scary people get a nuke or something equally awful. Honestly, that's the best case scenario. Ping me back if you... Hmm, an old Soviet plaque. Lenin lived. Lenin lives. Lenin will live forever. The Red Army is coming. I've been tracking them for weeks, watching as hundreds of men build the iron monstrosity across the ice. Men have died, their frozen bodies left scattered in the tundra. No rites of passing, no burial or burnings. These new invaders are cruel, godless men. Do they come seeking the precious... One fucking chance right now. 
tell us everything. <laughs> Yes, sir. But we didn't expect such heavy resistance. You were to be my eyes. I expected you to see. You must know what is at stake with this operation. Yes, but no. 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 You don't. No. How could someone like you... Go easy. Go easy. Don't fear the suffering. Our goal is within reach, but we must be vigilant. If we succeed here, a new world awaits. One of our own making. Constantine, you need it back at the prison right away. We've got a captive who might know something about the artifact. Remain faithful. We will share in the glory of the divine source. Oh God. What do we do with it? No. Nobody touch him. Looks like we got another fuel leak. What the hell happened? This thing is 50 years old. Looks like the valve failed. All right, let's get it shut. We can't afford to lose any more after that attack. Who's there? Okay. <laughs> Hold that part steady. Just need some more leverage. Damn it. Cover is dripped. You wanna get I think I heard something. I'll take a look. Roger. Huh. We'll check it out. Understood. destroy that tank. My eyes. Help me.
way to destroy that tank. Soviet propaganda. Night won't prevent us from working. Constantine is here, the man who tried to kill me in Syria. He's violent, dangerous, but worse, he appears entirely devoted to his misguided beliefs. I seem to have a habit of running afoul of religious zealots. And I suppose it all goes with the territory. His men on the radio mention a prisoner with information. Could it be one of the natives I've encountered? And if so, what does he know? Trinity will not be kind in their methods. Perhaps I can find him. Find out what he knows. Earning the trust of the locals might prove useful.
without being seen. you people all that can come later if you want answers then listen close we've managed to destroy the old radio tower but there are repeaters that keep them connected we need to shut them down help me and I'll let the others know they can trust you we need all the allies we can get I'll keep an eye out for them good you don't have much time that I should learn how to shoot. However, he tried to teach me today. I was utterly hopeless. I've always said in the field you can't go wrong with a stout stick and good boots. I told him I was a man of words, not of weapons. He laughed and said that he hoped I could find the right words to slow down a charging bison. I told him that's what he was for. Bless him for trying, though. I don't think there'll be any more lessons somehow. Roth always said I must have gotten my sharp eyes and steady hands from Mum. That summer, he taught me to shoot instead. I took to it. Maybe too well. Have you done it? Are the transmitters destroyed? I haven't found them all yet, but I will.
I've infiltrated the ranks of the enemy and learned that they come seeking the rich resources of the mountain. They appear to know nothing of the secret we protect. Those who build the Iron Road are themselves prisoners, slaves of the Red Army. Massive machines now use the Iron Road, bringing more slaves, food, and raw materials for construction of a small city 